Sam Tamer jumping into One Punch Man Season 2, Episode 4. Last we left off, some stuff was going down, some things happened, and more things will happen in the future. That's how yeah. TV shows work. And Fubuki is hot. It's super crazy. Uh, Garo. <laughs> Garo is wrecking everything. Uh, oh, that was good. That was good. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, we had, uh, I remember Saitama was going to enter a competition, some sort of like tournament or whatever. Is it like a dolphin with knowing kung fu or something? Yes. Anyway, and he was wearing a crazy wig and that led to a funny after credit scene with Genos, like going to do emergency hair transplant yes. surgery or whatever. <laughs> um, but anyway, let's go ahead, jump into it, see what's going down. I don't think so. No. So who is that? I don't remember I don't if know. that is a person that we know. I don't know. I'm like going through the Rolodex in my mind of like whoever was in last season. Yeah. I don't think I can't think do. of anybody offhand. They, they act familiar. like he was super famous though. Yeah. Which is what makes me think of my mask. Or he's just hot. Yeah, but they're like, aren't you like oh. whoever... Like, he's somebody to be known. Yeah, he might just be really cute to them. And, you know, mm -hmm. he's, like, a popular dude because he's good looking. Maybe that's why I'm so popular. Um, so, damn, for my <laughs> own freaking wow. I'm just saying, like, I'm not saying that you're not good looking. I'm just saying, like, it's kind of, like, big-headed to say that, you know? You're not talking to me anymore. It's kind of like... This is the <laughs> that's end like, That's like if I was like, saying. I'm so pretty... This is no more. You know, uh, this is that the, just makes me you're look cocky. witnessing the end of hugs and Sam. It just right makes here. you seem cocky. I, we're, I'm gonna switch it up. I'm gonna start making videos with my friend Zam. It's me, hugs and Zam. I'm not saying that you're not good looking. Obviously, you're good looking because you know I'm with you. <laughs> it's because of this neck beard that I'm sporting. Like That's this video if you want him to shave that off. <laughs> I'm not getting rid of it. <laughs> This is taking six months. I will let this grow and grow. It's just gonna, it's only gonna grow here, but I'm gonna have it down. I'm gonna look like just one Z top. Not ZZ top, but like one Z top. I'm gonna be like Goose Dynasty. I mean, I do not like straight duck, but petting it, but. I'll be like Pigeon Dynasty. Not straight duck dynasty. But I do like Miss Baby Face thing, so. Let us know what you thought. <laughs> No. Um, we talked a whole lot about the episode after. Yeah, no. <laughs> we, AKA so fears. I thought we would see more of the tournament. Yeah. Like of actually getting into the tournament in this yeah. episode. Other than that dude basically just talking trash, sour face, talking trash this whole time. Yeah. Basically downing Taranga though. And I'm hoping Saitama does well in the tournament, but like they don't find out it's not Taranga, so it like looks well on him. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. it makes his stock rise in that community. Yeah. Um, I think that'd be pretty cool. Um, his eyebrows are crazy. Who? The sour face? Yeah, sour face dude, yeah. Legit. I like <sighs> how they went back and they did amazing addition to the guy. Well, his <laughs> eyebrows are cool. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't know. Bro is really interesting he how is it sexy shows. you looked at me like i was weird but he is sexy like that bad boy thing he's got going i really like how they showed his mindset of as a child like he cheered for the bad guy and then it switched i, I well, like just because i identify with that yeah. like pro wrestling anime like even movies and stuff like that i love a good villain i yes. absolutely love a good villain i don't always cheer for the villain but i want to see like good storylines. Yeah. I, I don't want the hero to always just come in and easily clean up. That's why I was never yeah. like a big fan of Superman cuz Superman was just like always the embodiment of just perfect and good. 
and he just always seemed to save the day. This is like old school Superman, not like mm-hmm. modern comics and stuff like that have gotten more muddled. Yeah. But uh, I was always more into the characters that have flaws and, yeah. and aren't necessarily always good. Especially because, like, sometimes do good a lot of villains, like, there's a reason why they're a villain, and it's usually, like, a sad story. A good story origin story or, is yeah, necessary. Exactly. And while, like, you know, someone can have a sad, really sad story and not be a villain, you know, because it's, like, your own personal choice, but I still like to be, like, you know, see where they come, like, where they're coming from, you know? Well, that's, that's like, I, more what I like best out of villains. Well, that's why I like shows that have a villain and a hero that are basically the same person, just who took two different yes. paths. Yes. Like, you know what I mean? perfect example is, like, like, Avatar, like, you know, I was going like, to say that's a little but they, different, but it's They have different origin similarities, stories, but yeah. they're just the similar, like, two sides of, of the coin is yeah. what I like, yeah. Um... But I look at characters, you know, like Batman, who had a tragic, you know, thing happen. His parents are murdered in, in front of him or whatever. And, like, it's what he chooses to become or mm-hmm. ends up becoming. Um, you know, and it's, like, how these small things can spark stuff. Now, we don't know why he cheers for the villain. I don't know why I cheer for the villain. I think it's probably pro wrestling. Pro wrestling has just gotten me to where, like, I love to cheer the people that get booed. I don't know why, but I absolutely love it, especially when I would go with, like, my little nephews and stuff to the shows. Like, I would cheer so hard for the bad guys just to get at them, you know what I mean? And it's fun. Um, so I don't know. I don't, I, I really I don't like... As a character. I don't, I've never cheered for the bad guy, I don't think. I always cheer for the bad guy. Like, I mean, there's... Especially Razor Ramon. Like, there's it's a toothpick. very oh. few, like, bad guys that I'll be like, I like that. You know what I mean? Like, like this one, <laughs> I, like, I, I like his, like, vibe, like, his, like, mm-hmm. his look and stuff. I just think, yeah, I think that he, he looks, like, cool. And he's super and, powerful. Like, yeah. And an interesting character. Yes. And I think his, or there's way more to his origin story, and I really want to know more about it. I don't feel like he could, like, ever be good. Because it's been like a lifetime of him wanting to be a villain. He reminds me of a My Hero Academia character, though. Yeah. Like he just has that feel to him. He has a look. Yeah. Like kind of. It's the like same if style. Bakugo had went bad. Yeah. Or even Azuku. Yeah. I was thinking Azuku because Azuku grew up watching All Might. Yeah. And cheering for All Might, like he's the flip side of that instead yeah. of Justice Man, which is All Might. Yeah. He's like if Azuku had cheered for the bad guy. Yeah. That's the way that I look at. Yeah. Um, metal bat, though. He got some, like, metal balls, too. You know what I'm saying? That would be... If you're just a clank, like, you would never be able to be stealthy. I mean, like, he's like... Like, if you were just walking... He got balls. How are you going to sneak getting up? Getting up on that Senta... Senta Senpai... Senta Senpai was the second one. Senta Kohai, which... I think it goes by dojos. Because there's the... Ko- I think the Senpai is... The number two in the dojo, the Kohai is number three, and then whatever the last one was. was I don't like know the, nothing about any of what you're saying. Dojo. I think that's what it is. But whatever the know. dragon level one was, yeah. he was like up on his head and he just like started beating him up. Yeah. That's some metal balls. See, but if you try to sneak up on people though, just be like clanking, like walking. They ain't really metal that's balls. Not your, what is that thing where like... <laughs> Where you pull one side. Oh, like, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's just imagine him walking down the street and it's like, clank, clank. Balls are supposed clank, to be, like, together clank. in a sack. Like, yeah, but, like, they're not, like, would, apart. Like, yeah, but if it you're would apart, hit you ain't got a sack. And yeah, so but it would hit it. We're getting really gross right now. I just feel like it, they would be clapping all the time. Heck, please, heck, please. But metal balls. All right, let us know what you thought in the comment section down below. Like it if you did. Sub if you don't already. Shout out to our patrons watching the full and early reactions up on Patreon. Thank you so much for your support. You really don't know what it means. It means the world. We'll be back with more videos soon. We love you guys. Bye.